think of Arabs, what do we see? What images come to mind? Arabs are the most maligned group in the history of Hollywood. They're portrayed basically as subhumans. If we feel that Arabs are not like us, or not like anyone else, then let's kill them all then they deserve to die, right? Council of American Islamic Relations has noted a spike in hostility towards Muslims, including bomb threats at mosques, physical threats on Muslims themselves, even an advertising campaign telling Muslims to change their religion. But the Orientals are all the same, no matter where, the, where you find them. I mean, if it's in India or in Syria or in Egypt, it's basically the same essence. <laughs> in a bookkeeper job. I have two degrees and ten years experience. I came from Palestine. You know her? Who? Palestine. Is that a Jewish speaking country? No, Arabic. I am an Arab. Don't blow the place up. Airport, I could feel all the eyes on me, and our cameraman overheard one man tell his companion that he hoped I wasn't on his flight. Definitely things changed a lot after 9-11. I mean, before 9-11, you weren't called a terrorist. Um, it was after 9-11 that people would just stop to, to let you know that you're a terrorist. According to the FBI, hate crime incidents against Muslims soared from 28 in 2000 to 481 in 2001, and still remain well above pre-9-11 levels. <laughs> if Muhammad appears in South Park, we get bombed. That's yeah. 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 Now, we don't know that. Maybe enough time has passed that now it's okay to show Muhammad. But even if it were safe now for Muhammad to come, how, how would we ever find him? Yeah, showing an image of him is completely off-limits and censored. So nobody has ever seen what Muhammad looks like. I believe we can find Muhammad. I've done a lot of research and I've completed a sketch of what Muhammad could look like today. No, don't! Is that okay to show? I don't know. I guess we'll see. If we cannot see the Arab humanity, what's left? <laughs>